Hello student, let us start our discussion. So in previous session, we have discussed various type of shift operation. Uh, serial shift, then we have discussed logical shift, then circular shift and then arithmetic shift. And then we have discussed left shift and right shift in each type of shift micro operation. So in today's lecture or, or in today's session, we will continue our discussion with uh, shift uh, micro operation. So today we will discuss how we can implement the uh, shift micro operation. So let us start with the circuit as you can see in the figure. Uh, here we are having four two cross one multiplexer. So in each multiplexer we will have two input and there will be one output. If I want to select any one input from two input then uh, I have to uh, give one bit uh, selection input. So this S represent the selection input. Now let us see. Uh, what is input to each multiplexer here input uh, uh, input number 0 to first multiplexer is serial input from right side it can be 0 or 1 why because serial serial uh, data input can be anything so 0 or 1 input number 1 is from a1 next multiplexer input number 0 is from a0 and input number 1 is from a2 in next multiplexer input number 0 is from a1 and input number 1 is from a3 and in next multiplexer input number 0 is from a2 and input number 1 is from serial input left similar to serial input right here also i have written 0 or 1 okay so it can be an input now here uh, operation of this circuit is totally dependent on value of s okay so if value of s is 0 then there will be uh, some operation and then uh, if value of s is 1 then there will be some other operation so let us see which operations are performed when value of s is 0 and when value of s is 1 so uh, let us see s equals to 0 so whenever we will give s is 0 to all the multiplexer it will select the uh, input number 0 so here what is the input number 0 so here it is serial input from right side so here it will be 0 or 1 anything then here what is input number 0 a0 what is input number 0 here a1 and what is input number 0 a2 now here as you can see a0 is shifted to one position left hand side a1 is shifted to one position left hand side a2 is shifted to one position left hand side and a3 will be discarded okay so what we can say that whenever value of a s equals to zero then which operation will be performed it will be shift left now s equals to one so whenever value of s equals to one all multiplexer will select uh, input number one so what is input number one here input number one is a1 so here it will be a1 what is input number one here here input number one is a2 what is input number one here here it is a3 and what is input number one here serial input so it can be 0 or 1 so here you can see a1 is shifted one position right side a2 is shifted one position right side a3 is shifted one position right right side and on the blank space or on vacant space there will be input from serial input left so what we can say whenever value of s equals to one then shift right will be performed so this is how uh, shift circuit can be implemented this circuit is just for your understanding while in actual scenario or in real life scenario this circuit is uh, totally different compared to this one okay so in today's session uh, we will keep up to this thank you